Okay, why so then why, why do you dress this way? Dude, I'm hot and I like women, so please leave us alone. Well, Kindly. Well, take, take young I'm at the beach in take, my bathing take, suit. Yeah, that's, that's a thong and that's a bra. That's a take, fucking bathing take suit, Take young sir. eyes into consideration. They don't need to see pornography right We're not coming up to you bothering you. Please go away. You're flaunting your stuff. I'm not flaunting anything. Don't look at me. How, how, you look around and, and you're the only thing that sticks out because your whole body Okay, well, so why it. are you looking at me? Close your eyes. What no. did you say? Gouge no. your eyes no. out if I fucking did bother I ask you. you to talk to me? Here's the Please thing. We you did, Please you go. didn't, but there, but here's the thing. There's okay. free will in America. There's no, freedom bro. of speech. You don't want to get the fuck away. And, and, if, and, if, and if men of God don't stand up, then our society's gonna go go down the drain because there's no morality. I'm atheist, sorry. Yeah, same. But you're, okay, that, 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 that's if you're an atheist, that doesn't mean you have to, you know, show your body off. You can still put clothes on. Oh, I can't with you. <laughs> hey, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Oh my god, it's here's so thing. embarrassing. I can't. I'm speaking truth. Your body will never ever satisfy. Please, please. The physical never ever satisfy. There's a longing in each of your hearts to actually be seen. The reason why, <laughs> the reason why you're showing your body because you're like, Dude. am I pretty enough? We're definitely please pretty enough. Away. Thank you. <laughs> hey, I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Yes, please leave us just, alone. Just next time you come to a beach and there's young eyes, take that into consideration. Because, no, what are you because talking about? Guys, you're shirtless. You're not saying shit to them. Yeah, what are you fucking talking about? You're going to go follow that man now? Yeah, go Move through. along. That's a lot different. How, How is, is that, that different? Yeah. Because he has a this fucking is, dick? Is, is that why? Go down the drain because there's no... What the fuck? That, that's that's simply just bathing a family suit? outing. Bathing suits are pornography. That's not even a bathing suit anymore. What would, you like, what would you like what me to wear? What would you like me to wear? What do you consider a bathing a, a suit? A one-piece, literally. A one-piece. <laughs> or, 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 or a two-piece, or, or, or something like this that's actually modest because you don't need to be showing your body. Please just leave eyes. us alone. Please leave us alone, please. Thank you. I'm just saying. I hope okay. this actually touches Pull your head out of your eyes. Jesus. The next time you come out. Yeah, it actually made me feel. I actually really hate this. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's gonna come a day when you're gonna come face to face with God. <laughs> and, <laughs> and he says it's better for Did a Did you know milk. God says do not he judge? Said, he said it's better for a milk. He said, he said it's better for a milk. Oh, and if you find someone's body distracting, the, uh, then gouge your fucking I eyes know. out. Yeah, what about that one? <laughs> huh? What about that one? I'm not judge. Yeah, what do you mean? Why are you judging? What do you mean? I'm not judging you. Yes, you are. No, I'm I mean, I look like hold a hold up, hold up, hold up. This isn't productive. I have children and I know you guys care about kids. I do. Can I'm you tell him to leave us alone? Okay. He just came up to us unprovoked, please. Okay, he's going away. Okay. Yes. But I want yeah. you guys to think about the fact yeah. that what you guys are doing here does matter to kids. And I think you all have that. And I'm not so judging you. I'm not judging you. I'm not judging you. I have nothing to say as far as this goes. But you clearly do. In front of my kids, where I draw the line. Oh, you guys agree. And it does matter what you guys wear. Not because, not because of even what he said, but because you need to value yourself. If you're valuing yourself, that's the important thing. Okay? So that's what I'm saying. Thank you for your words. I think we can call this good now. Yes, we absolutely Great. can. Please stop talking. Okay, so this is everyone except Maddie who took the picture. None um, of them are thong style bikinis, which even if they were, it, it would, would not, not matter. matter. It wouldn't. But um, but this they were wearing. really normal bikinis. Yes, um, unprovoked. There were lots of other people wearing the same stuff. It was a public beach. Mm -hmm. We were the only ones that were just a female group. And that yes. is why he approached us, the fragile masculinity of the child. Yes, because we were vulnerable. And he thought that, I don't know what he thought was going on. Oh, we're sorry we didn't throw sand at him. Did I say that already? But I'm really sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah. There were men shirtless, and there was a guy in a speedo right by us, and he did not care. Laugh at Grossman 2021. <laughs> Anyways, thank you again. Bye. Hey guys, I'm Logan. I just wanted to get on here and to share my side of the story um, of a video that's going viral about me. Uh, that's saying I'm harassing women or I'm berating them or, you know, things of that nature. And so my side of the story is I was at um, a reservoir or a lake and I was with family members, um, all, you know, different ages. 
you know, from my age to college age, all the way down to a nine-year-old boy to a six-year-old boy, four-year-old girl and a two-year-old girl. And I had just, you know, come off the, the water from paddle boarding and somebody in my family said, hey, we've got to move. There's some college age women here that are showing too much. Um, and I don't want, you know, my son or, or my daughters to see these things. And so right then and there, I just had a, uh, just a righteous anger come over me. Um, and also just a, a boldness by the Holy Spirit to go in to confront these ladies and to speak truth that, hey, what you're wearing is not okay for a nine-year-old boy or a six-year-old boy. Um, and reason being is because coming from being introduced to pornography at a young age, it destroyed me. And I, in that moment, just a righteous anger of to defend and protect um, young eyes came over me. And so I just started to speak truth that, hey, you know, what you're wearing is not okay, that you can't find your worth in your body, um, that the physical will never satisfy, you know, that, uh, that there's going to come a day when you, then you're going to be face to face with God, um, you know, things of that nature. And, and so just to clear everything up, I, I don't, I'm not going to apologize. I'm just going to say I'm going to continue to stand on the truth. I'm going to continue to stand on the word of God. Our society is on such a downcline of morality. Pornography and lust is at an all-time high. People, um, you know, don't even know their gender anymore. People don't even know, um, you know, they, they can go from, you know, if they're, if they're born a male, they can be a female. If they're born a female, they can be a male. You know, society's really jacked up. And I'm going to continue to stand on the word of truth. I'm going to continue, continue to speak truth and be bold no matter the consequences. Um, you know, I'm, I'm longing for a revival in the hearts of men and women. I'm longing for people to be set free. And the only way they can be set free is by speaking the truth. It says, it, it says uh, plainly in Scripture that the, that, <clears throat> that the truth... The truth will set them free. Not acceptance, uh, not compliments, but the truth. And so I'm going to speak truth. What they were wearing was not okay for a nine-year-old, nine-year-old's eyes or a six-year-old boy's eyes. And man, yes, God loves you guys. God loves you. I hope, I hope the women watching this are watching. Um, man, God loves you. But man, you can't find your worth in your body. There's a longing deep in your soul that only Jesus can satisfy.